As a rule, games between these sides have you on the edge of your seat. They're certainly the two most successful teams in England with such passionate fans. Stay with us, we'll bring you all the action from Anfield as Liverpool face Manchester United. It's always a fascinating confrontation. Liverpool, who dominated English football in the 70s and 80s, against Manchester United, who rather knocked them off their perch in the 90s and the 2000s. Derek Ray, along with Stuart Robson here in the commentary position, always a special occasion when they lock horns here at Anfield, Stuart. Well, you're right, Derek. It's Anfield, it's Liverpool versus Manchester United. They don't get much bigger than this. Let's hope the game matches the hype. This should be good. And this is how Liverpool will line up. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. Well, it's a defensive lineup, that's for sure. But their wing backs and at least one of their midfield players will need to break forward when they regain possession, just to give them a threat going forward. A match that should be chock full of talking points. Liverpool get it going. And he's won the ball. to bring you from one of the other games and big news at that here's Alex Scott yeah it was a penalty for Villa the goalkeeper comes away as a hero because he saved the day it remains nil nil with only three minutes played Alex with the info as ever oh what an opportunity in it goes but it will not stand Offside, Stuart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. Really good interception. Beck. It's a good Liverpool move in the making. And he successfully got past him. Jovan Cabral. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Well, a top notch piece of defensive judgment. Well, the fans have been wondering how this might go. It is his debut game. Stuart, what should we be looking for from him today? Well, it seems like a good signing to me. They've had some problems at the back in recent years, so I think they just want someone they can depend on week in, week out. He reads the game well, though, and certainly can handle himself, so I expect him to fit in well here. Luis Diaz. Out for a Liverpool throw. Cissé. Fabinho. 
Well, it all counts for naught. Fratesi. Davide Fratesi. Well, they keep working away, looking for passing lanes. Who can he pick out? The cross played over and work to do defensively. Fabinho. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Holland. A really top notch piece of defending. Davide Fratesi. Still passing it around with authority. Top class defending. This could be dangerous if he's not careful. Fabinho. Cissé. Possession one. Armel Benacocha. Anthony. Davide Fratesi. Mejbri. Now he must favour the cross. Well, making contact with the ball, but couldn't quite keep his header down. Clarkson. It's with Fabinho. Promising attack this. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Bella Cocha. Gonzalo Inacio. And the Liverpool throw in forthcoming. An effective challenge. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Well, threat over for now. Fabinho. And offside it is. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Fine cross into the middle. Well, he couldn't get the header on the target, but robust defending. Those stats tell you everything. A tight and cagey game without enough goal mouth action. Both teams need to get more players forward if they're to pose a real threat. Crossing opportunity. Can they forge ahead? And there it is! The opener in the derby falls for United! A real jolt to the home fans. Not what they were expecting. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal.
Well, back on the way. Will that goal have the effect of stinging Liverpool into action? Cissé. It's a perfect challenge. Manchester United Davide Fratesi Inacio and the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute they might be able to get in now oh that's a fine save no more time left first half is over here at Anfield The second half underway, United with the advantage, but no room for complacency. a deflection that'll be a corner taken short the inside route looks promising spot on with that tackle Clarkson Beck the referee has let the advantage accrue to Liverpool Oh, that's a pass of high quality. And no joy as far as the cross was concerned. Well, it smacks into the gloves of the goalkeeper. Well, there you have it. Liverpool just haven't got going today. And that last attempt sums them up. Not quite good enough. Well, many have wondered if they would get it over the line in terms of the deal. They've succeeded, Stuart. Yeah, and at that price, it seems like very good business, doesn't it? Looking forward to seeing his debut and hopefully he can hit the ground running. Can they take advantage? And he brought up the attack with a masterful tackle. And they're making a change. Fabinho. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. United being afforded too much space. Oh, a vital interception. Alexander-Arnold. Right, Alex, quickly over to you, because I think there's been a goal at Craven Cottage. It's the goal for Fulham. They're back level. It's 1-0 with 59 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. They need to stop him. Oh, surely! Well, you have to say, he's going to be very cross with himself. He'll certainly be disappointed with that. That was a poor effort. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And they're trying to get right into his face. Now, options are plenty. Plenty. 
Holland. Shot attempted. Really good diving save. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Well, opting for the short corner. And making his move inside. And the keeper's delighted to see that sail well over the bar. Goal kick. And I'm hearing there's been a goal in the Fulham game. Alex Scott can fill us in. It's a second goal for Chelsea. He shot far post, the keeper parries it, but the rebound has been put in nicely. They've pulled one back and now trail by one with 66 minutes play. Thanks as always, Alex. Jovan Cabral. And reading it absolutely superbly. Well, don't forget, action from the fourth round of the FA Cup is coming your way on EA TV. It's Liverpool taking on Rotherham United. Well, that's a game to look forward to. Plenty to play for in that one. It should be a really entertaining game. Alexander-Arnold. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Fabinho. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Anthony. He's in with a chance. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? forget action from the fourth round of the FA Cup is coming your way on EA TV it's a oh, big chance here Derek and a goal calls for celebrations again two in front well here's the replay watch how he goes past his man with such ease and it's just a change of pace and when he gets onto it he decides to go for power it's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. And all the way through to the keeper. Fratesi. Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. Plenty of support here. Going to get a try. Oh, the goalkeeper did well to hang on to that one. Manchester United unable to retain possession. Cisse. It's with Fabinho. Oh. 
Well, not far away from full time now, and United excelling here. Yeah, this has been a good performance. They've looked really sharp going forward, and they've shown a lot of energy. They'll certainly be pleased with their overall display up to now. Bradley. Now with Alexander Arnold. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Bustamante. Holland. And that puts them in position. Holland. Gives it a go. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Stones. Tuta. And brave goalkeeping to deal with the danger. Well, he had to get that right, didn't he? That's good goalkeeping. And can they exploit the space out wide? And that is the end of the game. It goes down as a United triumph. The fans are going to be happy with this. Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer. And Stewart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent. into the middle Anthony he's in with a chance no hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead well that was a poor miss could they come oh big chance here Derek and a goal Calls for celebrations again. Two in front. Crossing opportunity. Can they forge ahead? And there it is. The opener in the derby falls for United. A real jolt to the home fans. Not what they were expecting. All right, just a couple of questions for you. Thanks, that's all the questions we have for you.